Yeah, that's right. So tomorrow they have the Women Against Violence luncheon that's happening. It's a big fundraiser for Samaritan House happening at the Weston Town Center uh, in Virginia Beach here. Check-in starts at 1130. Our own Kristen Crowley there, she's going to be the host for it. Uh, but joining me now is Catherine Ashford. She's here with Samaritan House. I want to talk to you first about, well, first of all, thank you so much for joining us this morning. I know it's really <laughs> early. Uh, for those who don't know, let's talk about what Samaritan House offers the community. Absolutely. Yeah. So we've been around for 35 years. It's our 35th anniversary. And what we provide for the Hampton Roads community is safe emergency housing and programs for victims of violence. So families and children who've been torn apart have been victimized by things like domestic violence, sexual violence, even human trafficking, as well as homelessness. If there's violence in your home, it's not safe to be there anymore. And oftentimes those families or individuals will become homeless. And so we've been a part of the community, like I said, for 35 years providing those services to anyone who needs them. Um, I think there's a lot of myths and stereotypes that only women experience violence, and that's just not true. Violence doesn't discriminate. It doesn't know a gender or an age, a race or religion. It's, it's all people who can experience violence, and therefore we serve anyone who needs us with that emergency housing and programs, things like counseling, children's services, victim advocacy, so keeping people safe mm -hmm. by helping them walk through the legal process. Okay, so both m women and men. Mm -hmm. uh, tomorrow's event specifically is uh, women who are going to be telling their stories, right? And when, you, when we talk about a fundraiser, I mean, you guys are a nonprofit, so mm -hmm. what what do these events do, you know, to keep these programs here going? Yeah, that is a really good question. So we are a nonprofit. Uh, we are grant funded to so the federal government and the state give us money to run our programs to hire the best and brightest staff to receive training. But when we don't, um, when we run out of money, when we run out of grant money, when there are gaps in that funding, it's the community, it's the fundraisers that allow us to continue that. So the Women Against Violence Luncheon tomorrow at the Weston is, is a way that we do that. It helps meet uh, unmet needs, things like diapers. There's no grants for diapers. Things like... Um, art supplies or um, uh, food, counseling services that are vital in a, mm -hmm. in a client's healing process. Uh, fundraisers help us to meet those unmet needs and it's through the community. So the members of WAVE have been working really hard <laughs> to organize the event and to, to advertise it, to let people know like, hey, you're not just coming and having a salad, but you are learning about the impact of violence in our community. Mm -hmm. And by being here, you're sending a message to survivors, you're heard yeah. and you are known and you're helping us raise those funds to keep those programs going. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. Again, this luncheon happening tomorrow, 1130 at the Weston Town Center in Virginia Beach. All the information on our website, WTKR.com. We have much more coming later this morning on News 3 and WGNT. We'll send it back to you.